Hi, it's Josh here from Bowman Lawyers. Today in this video, I want to talk to you about the category of low range drink driving in Queensland. So when it comes to low range driving in Queensland, um, this means where a person on a full open license, they have a blood alcohol limit of 0.050. If they record a blood alcohol reading of 0.050, Five O or higher, but less than 0.100, then they will be put into the low range category. Now, when it comes to penalties in relation to uh, a low range drink driving offence in Queensland, the maximum penalty for this particular offence can carry uh, three months in prison. So it is no joke, uh, drink driving, especially in Queensland. Um, uh, a low range drink driving offence, everyone thinks it's just a slap on the wrist, maybe serve some time off the road, but there is a, 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 there is a possibility, there is a, a maximum penalty there of prison time. Now, it doesn't generally happen for most cases, but every case is dealt with on a case by case basis uh, and a lot of different factors will come into play. Um, certainly, um, the court will always look for other penalties and other avenues and use prison as a penalty of last resort. Um, but let it be known that um, a drink driving, a low range drink driving um, as a first offence does have a maximum um, uh, penalty of three months in prison uh, and, or, and a, um, a monetary financial penalty of 14 penalty units. Um, upon finding uh, a finding or a plea of guilty for low range drink driving, then the court is obligated to disqualify a, an offender's driver's license for anywhere between one month, which is the minimum period they can do. They can't give any less than that. So one month is the minimum right through to nine months being the maximum period for a low range drink drive on a first offence. Now, if you've been charged with low range drink drive and you've got a second offence within the last five years, then the maximum penalty that a court can issue for an offender charged with a low range drink drive as a second offence uh, is six months in prison or a penalty, financial penalty of 20 penalty units. Uh, in relation to uh, the period of disqualification for low range drink drive uh, clusters or categorised as a second offence, then the disqualification period uh, is increased. The minimum period is three months and the maximum period is 18 months. For a, a low range drink drive, which is categorised as a third offence in the last five years, if you've got two prior drink drive convictions in a fight last five years, then this will be considered a third uh, drink driving offence. Um, and if it's a low range one, a third within the last five years, then the prison maximum prison maximum penalty is imprisonment for a period of nine months uh, and a maximum penalty of 28 penalty units. If it is a third low range drink drive for a person, then the disqualification period is still anywhere between three months through to 18 months. And obviously each matter is dealt with on a case by case basis in relation to the history, the facts, the character, all sorts of issues which will come into play uh, for the court to consider when considering what sort of penalty to hand down. Now, if a person has been charged with a low range drink driving offence uh, and it is their first offence, they've got no prior um, suspensions or disqualifications in the last five years, they may be eligible to apply for a Section 87 work licence. Uh, there are some more details that we go through in relation to applying for a work licence at our website and in one of our other videos. So look out for that video if you would like to apply for a work licence because there are a number of strict eligibility criteria involved and you certainly want to make sure that you know you are eligible to apply before um, before going down that rabbit hole. Um, so that's today's video really encompassed uh, first, second and third offences of low range drink driving in Queensland and what sort of penalties can apply to those particular categories.
I want to thank you for tuning into Borman Lawyers today. You can catch us at any of the usual social media platforms. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you've got any questions or queries, please don't hesitate to contact us on 1300 941 900. Hey guys, thanks for tuning into this video today. I really hope it was informative and helpful for you. There's another couple of videos below that you might want to check out that may be very useful for the process that you might be going through at the moment. Please feel free to like, follow, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel because we've always got fresh new content coming through all the time.